Hello, this is George Moore, owner of Moore's Sewing Center in Southern California. And I'm here uh, at my uh, warehouse, actually, in my conference room. And I just got back from the uh, VDTA, the national, or national convention, where they uh, unveiled the new Janome Continental M17. And uh, our store machines just arrived. I have one here. And I thought, you know, I've never done an unboxing video. And that's why I'm, I'm totally in my casual uh, 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 outfit here. Normal, just came to the warehouse just to start playing on this machine. And I figured, let's do this here. So I'm going to document this because what I'm doing is I'm preparing for our spring technology parties. And uh, so I'm going to be actually taking over this conference room all this week, kind of getting my, my presentations ready. But I thought I would just, just start by, by showing you the size of this machine. Now, this is the embroidery unit. Now, I put a water bottle here to just kind of get perspective the size of this here. And you go, oh my goodness, how, why is that so big? Well, remember, this is they, they, this is engineered to be the finest and more, most durable machine for embroidery, sewing, and quilting ever invented. And so when we have a machine that is, has a foundation of quality, we have to have an embroidery unit that has a foundation of quality. And so let's go ahead and take some time to take a look at this. Okay, I got the box opened here and I went through and I took all the tape off so that way we can just kind of go through the box. And let's see what's in here. This is pretty much packaging here. Now this right here, this is these are the many accessories. In fact, off the top of my head, I was listening. There was 92 different ex, uh, feet and accessories that they're including. And uh, don't quote me if I'm wrong, but I know I'm, I'm close to that there. And um, you know, there's just so many, and I'm not going to go through each one of them. But every single accessory you could think of comes with it. Now, there's a lot of different feed systems because the great thing about this is it has the Accu uh, Feed Flex. That that's probably the best feeding system in the industry. Um, this right here, we're going to talk about this in the, in the upcoming weeks. This is the stitch regulator, the, the AccuStitch regulator, and it can work with different accessories. That's unlike any other. Um, it also has a very unique uh, fabric guide that attaches directly to the bed of the machine. That's something that, that's going to be a cool thing to show. Um, there are, I'm not, again, I'm not going to go through everything. Oh, these are special magnets that attach to a quilting frame that we're going to talk about. They've got magnifiers that attach to the machine. Again, this is just unboxing, but I, I stay tuned for the weeks to come with different things I might uh, talk about. But let's go ahead and put this back here and see what else is in here. Okay. And uh, let me know how you like this unboxing video. I might, I might do this again in the future with other machines, but uh, again, my first unboxing here. So uh, needle plates, um, that's one thing about this. It has an automatic needle plate uh, removal. You press the screen and it removes it. And they have different accessory plates uh, for uh, patchwork uh, piecing. Uh, the high performance plate has a single hole. So it gives a, 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 on the left side, so it gives you, the, that's the sweet spot. So that way you can uh, sew heavier and, and more difficult fabric. Got a knee lift. Uh, let's see what else is in here. Oh, this is the embroidery foot with the laser guide. Uh, probably have the best buttonhole system on the market. More, more feeding systems. Uh, so we've got that. Then let's open this up here. What do we have? Ooh, we got the machine. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and lift this up on the table and change the camera camera position. So here's the machine, and uh, first of all. Kind of gives you perspective. Uh, so often, actually, uh, thus far, you really only see have seen this machine attached to the embroidery unit. So when you sew and quilt, you can just have the machine out. And I want to tell you, this is the most advanced sewing and quilting machine right here. Now uh, there is 13 and a half inches of space from uh, the center needle position over. But the main thing is this foundation of quality. This is a complete um, single casted aluminum housing. There's no seam on this at all, so it's so smooth. But this is why they're focusing on the high definition quilting and high definition sewing because of this foundation of quality. It also has a motor that can sew through such a heavy fabric um, because it's a 12 core DC drive motor uh, and it is it's amazing. So what we have here, when I turn it on, you'll see this here. There's a screen here and there's a screen, a beautiful 
10 inch screen, 10.1 inch screen. And uh, this is a capacitive screen that has over, I think almost nearly 17 million color variations. So you see it in true life. Uh, I like the fact that you have actual adjustment knobs on the width and length, uh, but you'll, you'll see the controls when I turn it on. It's, it's beautiful. It's just a sleek looking machine. Um, right here, I push this button. Is that nice? This just gradually comes up and I um, push this lever. There's is cool pins and this right here has a retractable telescopic thread guide here. Um, now on the side here you have, first of all, I, I love the ergonomics of both the, the hand wheel um, and then the handle itself. And then it has uh, two USB ports and a USB cable port as well. And um, actually, let's go ahead and I'll get the view here adjusted. Uh, let's go ahead and turn it on. And let's see here, the lighting, okay. Now that is the largest lighting area, okay. And uh, brilliant, beautiful lighting uh, across the whole bed of the machine there. So it's, it's turning on here. It's telling me to raise the needle bar slowly. And it comes to life, okay. Now this is the cool thing here. So again, this is the screen. It's just so clear. I love the large size of this and this is simple. We're not going to go into a demo of this here, but I'm just kind of going over the features I love about this here. Um, but this is what's really cool. Let's take a zigzag. And like many machines, you can you know, adjust it right on the screen and you see that. But the problem is when you're way over on this side right here, you're, you, this is your comfort zone. This is your focus, your sewing. You have to come all the way over here to sew, to, to make your adjustments. But look what they did here. They gave you an adjustment. Here's your width, right here. Your length, right here. You can see the screen changing. Your, your tension setting, which is automatic, but automatic means it goes to a, the, the right setting, but you sometimes want to override it. And then the, the pressure on the foot. You do also have adjustments variably, like I told you. So that's so comfort. Now, they really thought through this because this right here is the little Thumb, thumb wheel. So, so I actually, I'm gonna try to do this so you can see it here. Just this little, and it's not, I'm not feeling pressure. It, it's all done with electronic motors. So I can just put my needle right down into the fabric. Okay, isn't that cool? So um, let's take a look at the embroidery unit. Okay, so we have the embroidery unit box here. And so I partly opened it so I can video this better. Uh, okay, so what we have, let's get this open. We've got some items that still belong to the sewing part of the machine. Uh, this, uh, they give you some extra stabilizer and fabric, that's kind of cool. Uh, this right here is a, 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 a kind of a canvas hard, not hard shell, but it's a, a sturdy uh, dust cover of the machine itself. So we'll put this aside here. Uh, this is, this is kind of a cool thing. This is an accessory uh, holder. And so it's a unit here. Let me see if I can do this and hopefully we can pick this up. Logo Janome here. There's so many accessories, like I mentioned, but look at that. Look at that. Isn't that cool? Since it's soft sided, it's padded, goes with the machine. And uh, again, we have an introductory special, which includes beautiful luggage, and all this will go beautiful with it here. Uh, okay, so it, there's a total of one, two, three, four, and I'll talk about a fifth hoop that comes with it. And the fifth one's a special one. This is the giant. 8.1 by 11 inch hoop, and I'll open it up and show you how, how wonderful that is. Uh, what you have here, these are actually extension tables to the embroidery unit. So I'll, I'll put one of those on when I have that on the table. And right here, we've got special box. Now for a limited time, inside this box, they're in, including this embroidery quilting kit. And it's more than just uh, quilting, it's, it's everything. Because what it has are including the artistic Digitizer Junior. This is a very powerful program. That's for both Windows and Mac. And you can create your own designs, but also you can create quilting, um, well, stippling and decorative quilting to be used with this hoop. And I'm gonna play with that today, actually. Um, uh, you won't see that till later. But uh, this hoop is, uh, it's really more of a frame, not a pin of hoop. So it has these large clamps and it's 10 and a half by 10 and a half inches. 
and it's perfect for edge to edge quilting. And because we have so much room, we're using this as an automated quilting machine. So stay tuned for a little video, you know, in the future on this here. Um, not in this video, but in the future. Okay, so let's take and put this aside. We're out of room here. Um, like the foot pedal itself, as well as you have a, a, a sidecar foot pedal on either, you put on either side for remote controlling the cutter, which is kind of cool. Do that in there. Now let's see what's in here. Obviously the board unit. And look at that thing, that's huge. Um, so we're gonna talk further about this, but this is a, a gantry style, gantry of the supported overhead, almost like a crane embroidery mechanism here that moves back and forth. So it's support on both sides. And it, inside is completely casted. Uh, which is, well, I've got some pictures of, maybe I'll pop one up here, of what it is. So there's casting on the front side, front side and back side, and there's 23 different bearings and even 11 needle bearings, DC motors. I mean, this is the most advanced engineered embroidery mechanism. I mean, this is a machine by itself. It's, it's incredible. So let's go ahead and get this up on, on the uh, table and uh, uh, hook it up to the machine. So we have the embroidery unit attached here. And uh, first of all, I wanna go back over some of those accessories. I, I took them out of the box and I placed them inside uh, the accessory holder here. So I wanna just pinpoint some of the things that, uh, to highlight some of the, the, the uh, items that are really unique that come with this machine. So let's take a closer look at this. So as I mentioned, this machine comes with 92 different accessories uh, and different uh, notions and things that, that make your sewing experience easier and more enjoyable. But this box really shows a lot. They leave some spaces open because obviously there's other items. I think Janome makes more accessories than any other uh, sewing machine manufacturer I'm, I'm aware of. But um, these are some of the different AccuFlex feed systems, which are top feeds in different configuration to give you the best fabric control. I mean, everything is labeled by the foot, the letter uh, for the foot, and it goes in there very nicely. You got room for bobbins here. Let's see what we have here. We have. I mentioned the different plates where you can store the different plates here um, and more feeding systems. Now, this, this is the magnifiers. I showed you in the, when they were um, in the plastic, but these are different magnifiers that attach to this machine. I'm going to actually grab this for later. I'm going to show you how this attaches. I'm going to take that out here. And then I really did this because I needed to, I'm going to do it my first project uh, shortly. And um, you'll see that in an upcoming video. Uh, and I needed to pull out my screwdriver and my scissors. So I figured, let's go ahead and show you all the different things here. So I'll show you what we'll do with these here and where we're going to put them for use. Uh, and then uh, there's a buttonhole. I mean, it's just, it's just so well organized and it's just so nice. I mean, again, being the top model in the industry, they, they're pulling out all the stops and uh, everything is so cool. I love this, this holder here. It sits right up. And uh, let's just go take a closer look at a couple of the other items. Okay, so uh, I mentioned I pulled out a couple of accessories here. First, the screwdriver, because I'm gonna change to my embroidery foot, which has a bigger mechanism. But look at this, I can store it. There's magnetic holders up here, which is really cool. For your most common accessories, there's another one here, and there's some other charts you can put up there. There's uh, some compartments for more feet. So, I mean, everything that, that you'll use just in, in that setting, which is cool here. Now, on the side here, Janome is the only brand out there today that still has it, so you can actually open up and get into the mechanism. So first of all, you see all that metal in there, the steel and uh, just cast and stuff like that. So it's just, just made so well. Um, but also this is quite unique. Um, I can actually take this and this is the, the magnify holder. I can attach it right here like so. It swings in there. Now it has an automatic needle switch, so you don't use that for, you don't, you don't use the magnifier for, um, you know, thready, but sometimes you just want to see where the needle comes down. And let's say I want to use that thumb wheel right here, and I can just put that down. You just have that, that precision. They really have thought through everything in your sewing experience. So that's really a cool thing. So uh, I've got the embroidery unit attached to the machine. And as I mentioned, this embroidery mechanism is the most sophisticated embroidery mechanism ever introduced. Now, inside here, the, the machine, the, the, the embroidery mechanism is casted. That means it has complete aluminum casting to actually front, 
back and middle support. And I want to pop up a, a picture of that on the screen. Now that's what holds everything together. And the problem with a lot of embroidery units, they don't have the substance. So in time or just with heat of use, you start seeing things go out of, out of registration. So they coined the phrase, actually uh, trademarked the frames, high definition embroidery. That's because of this. Now the mechanism itself, it has, I mentioned casting, but there's, there's tracks uh, on both sides with tracks of ball bearings, okay? And, and where a lot of machines are just on belts, this has 23 different ball bearing points, uh, and 11 of them are needle bearings. And so this mechanism, this embroidery mechanism, as it moves, it's supported and ran on tracks on both sides where every other mechanism, as this moves uh, across here and, uh, and to the front of the bed, every point of this is supported. And this top part moves like a crane, uh, as you see here. So again, Everything is meant to give you the best quality in embroidery. Now, uh, the hoop itself, see if I can get that into the screen, it's so big. You see it's the hoop's a machine. It's incredible. Okay, so this is a, a, a 18 inches long by 11.1, the largest available on the household market. Now, the material is reinforced by carbon Fiber. Now, carbon fiber is actually 10 times stronger than iron, but it weighs obviously less. This is sturdy, sturdy stuff, so it can hold the fabric and hold the, the just the weight and the speed, um, which we'll talk about that. Uh, it's actually 1,200 stitches per minute, fastest on the, in, in the household market. Each side, both sides here, have these nice clamps that are sturdy, and you can fine-tune them, so that way it's easier to get the fabric in tightly but see what happens when you loosen up you can get it in there and then tighten it down so often you can't get the fabric in tight enough and uh, that's where this truly supports it uh you know when you're working with large larger products uh, larger uh, uh, um, projects and so that's really cool now speaking of support the bed of the machine they really thought through this here so as we look at this here oh actually i want to talk, tell you one more thing about the embroidery hoop uh, most of the hoops they come with these grids. Now, a lot of the companies, they've eliminated the grids and people complain, they even make their own. This actually uh, comes with grids for each one of these here. Um, so you gotta support that type of hoop, okay? You can see that's why it has the bed of this machine and um, this right here has support here, but I, I purposely did not put the front uh, ta extension table on. I want you to see this here. So let Okay, so right here is the front of the embroidery mechanism, and they actually have it so you can open it up, and there's storage, and there's my embroidery foot with the laser uh, guide on there, because we're gonna plug that in and use that later. But what's important is that they wanted us to support the size of this hoop, and so the, you have these extension leaves, and this actually just seats down like so. And so now, this hoop, is supported. I haven't changed my foot yet here, so I'm going to raise my needle up and slide this in the hoop. So you can see that's going to support that length. And, and that's important too, because you've got bulky fabric and it might um, affect the way this, this, this uh, um, the quality, okay? And so uh, we're going to actually, I'm going to uh, change the view again and just show you the, the design I'm going to stitch out. And I'll show you that in future videos, but let's go ahead and uh, I'll show you here. Here we have the home screen, and I like the, how easy it is to see. You've got your uh, ordinary sewing, sewing application, and embroidery mode. So we'll choose embroidery mode, okay? And uh, we'll go ahead and pull that up here. And it has over 1,200 built-in um, patterns, uh, but I want to see it based on the hoop size because I know I'm going to use a large hoop. So I'm going to pull this up here, and I've got their RE460. Uh, hoop that's their large one here and i'm going to do actually number 46 i actually uh, that's i have selected it before so it's going right back to it um and this design right here uh, i i actually showed it in the last video because genomi had it stitched out but i don't they wouldn't give me the sample so i have to stitch my own and so uh we're gonna just real quickly i change it to inches uh it comes to default millimeters so it's uh lengthwise is a 17.7 of the 18 inch hoop, and this is 10.6 by the 11.1 inch hoop. And it shows you, I, I, I raise it to the maximum embroidery speed, 1200 stitches per minute. Uh, for sewing, it's 1300 stitches per minute, both in this class that are the largest. It gives you a recommendation of foot and hoop, obviously, uh, gives you the color selection, uh, the stitch, this has over 90,000 stitches, 
And so, and you can access any of those there and you can scan through them. It's, it's just a lot, it's, it's clean. And we're gonna talk more later about different apps and stuff like that here. But um, I'm gonna go ahead and just attach this here to the machine uh, and this, this, I love the attachment. Uh, it just slides in so nicely and it senses the hoop here. And uh, as you see, we're stitching it out here and uh, let's, let's take a look at how well this stitches. Okay, the embroidery's done. It's flawless. Um, and I will tell you, I was just really enjoying uh, operating this here. It's, it's so smooth. And the way this embroiders, I've not seen any other machine like this. And I do a lot of embroidery. Um, and the detail in the stitching, the layering, again, I'm just amazed. Uh, but I want to invite you to come uh, see this machine and others as I present them at our spring sewing technology parties. This, this is May 9th through 13th at all of our locations in Southern California. And you can click on the link uh, to uh, get a, uh, just go to that page and uh, register because we are limited in the spacing. Uh, but you want to see this. We're going to have prizes, great pr uh, prices as well. Uh, but I'm going to have a lot of fun here. And um, I'm, you know, actually, this is what I'm preparing for. So I might throw a couple other videos out there as, as I get ready. So again, you don't want to miss the spring technology parties. And um, I hope to see you soon. Bye for now.